A study was made of 200 students to determine what cartoons they watch. It was found that 22 students don't watch these cartoons. 73 students watch only Tiny Toons. 136 students watch Tiny Toons. 14 students watch only Animaniacs and Pinky and the Brain. 31 students watch only Tiny Toons and Pinky and the Brain. 63 students watch Animaniacs. 135 students do not watch Pinky and the Brain. The question that we're asked is how many watched only Pinky and the Brain? Well, in order to answer this question, we can use the Venn diagram over here on the right, where we have one circle representing all the students that watch Tiny Toons, another circle that represents all the students that watch Animaniacs, and a third circle that represents all the students that watch Pinky and the Brain. Let's read through our clues and fill in the Venn diagram. Well, first of all, we're given that 22 students don't watch these cartoons. That corresponds with region eight, everything outside of the three circles. So we can write the number 22 in this region. Next, we're given that 73 students watch only Tiny Toons. That corresponds with region one. So in region one, we can put the number 73. Next, we're given that 136 students watch Tiny Toons. However, Tiny Toons is everything inside of the Tiny Toons circle, and that includes four regions rather than one. So we'll come back and try to fill that in later. Next, we know that 14 students watch only Animaniacs and Pinky and the Brain. That corresponds with region six. So we can put the number 14 in region number six. Next, we know that 31 students watch only Tiny Toons and Pinky and the Brain. That corresponds with region four. So we'll go ahead and put the number 31 in region number four. Our next clue is that 63 students watch Animaniacs. So we know that if we add up regions two, three, five, and 14, it needs to add up to 63. But unfortunately, we don't know what number goes in any particular region. So we'll move on to the next clue. 135 students do not watch Pinky and the Brain. That means that everything outside of the Pinky and the Brain circle needs to add up to 135. But unfortunately, we've got a couple regions out there. So it looks like we'll need to write some equations to represent the numbers in the unknown regions. So let's go back to the first clue that we haven't used yet. The first clue that we haven't used is that 136 students watch Tiny Toons. So let's go ahead and shade in the Tiny Toons circle. We know that the sum of these four regions has to be 136. So we'll write an equation to represent that. 31 plus 73 plus region 2 plus region 5 must add up to 136. The next clue that we haven't used is that 63 students watch Animaniacs. So let's go ahead and shade in the Animaniacs circle. And what we know is that the sum of these four regions must be 63. So we can write another equation. Region two plus region three plus region five plus 14 must be equal to 63. And finally, the last clue that we haven't used is that 135 students do not watch Pinky and the Brain. So we'll go ahead and shade in everything outside of the Pinky and the Brain circle. And what we know is that the sum of these four regions must be 135. So region 2 plus region 3 plus 73 plus 22 must be equal to 135. Well, we've used up all the clues, so let's see if we can use these equations to figure out the number of students in each of the missing regions. In this first equation, we'll go ahead and get the variables on one side and the constants on the other. So we'll go ahead and subtract 73 and 31 from 136. That gives us 32. So region 2 plus region 5 is equal to 32. In this second equation, we'll go ahead and subtract 14 from both sides, and that will give us region two plus region three plus 
region 5 is equal to 49. And then finally in this third equation we'll subtract 73 and 22 from both sides and that gives us region 2 plus region 3 is equal to 40. Well notice that we've got region 2 plus region 3 in a couple of different places. Region 2 plus 3 is here and region 2 plus 3 is over here and we know that region 2 plus 3 is 40 so we can put the number 40 in place of region 2 plus region 3. That gives us 40 plus region 5 is equal to 49 and subtracting 40 from both sides tells us that region 5 contains 9 students. Well, now that we know that region 5 contains 9 students, we can substitute in 9 students over here and we get region 2 plus 9 is equal to 32 and subtracting 9 from both sides gives us region 2 contains 23 students. And once we know that region 2 has 23 students, we can substitute that in over in our last equation to get 23 plus region 3 is equal to 40. Subtract 23 from both sides and we find out that region 3 contains 17 students. Well, we figured out the number of students in all the different regions except for region 7. And unfortunately, that happens to be the region we're looking for. How many watched only Pinky in the Brain? Well, that is region number 7. So how are we going to figure that out? Well, the only thing we haven't used is that the study was made of 200 students. We know that all the numbers need to add up to 200. So let's take 200 and subtract all these numbers away. And the number that we end up with is 11. So how many watched only Pinky of the Brain? 11 students.